What's good with YouTube? It is your boy Vaughn, and as you guys can see by the title, we are back with a new banger SML reaction video for you guys today. This one dropped about 10 minutes ago, and it is called SML Movie Junior's Crazy Assumption. So this is actually a title that we have no idea what could possibly take place in this because this is an assumption. Assumption is something that uh, you think is happening, or it, it, it could be, I'm assuming right now, we could anything we say could be an assumption, literally, right now. So we're going to dive right into this so we can find out for ourselves. As always, the original video will be in the description down below while you guys are down there. If you'd like to follow me on my other channel, I am dropping a video over there tomorrow, so I will greatly appreciate the support. Make sure you guys are subscribed to this channel with notifications turned on. That way you do not miss any of the uploads, man. And without further ado, let's check out Junior's crazy assumption. Let's get it, baby. Uh, Joseph, I don't want to go to school today. <laughs> Me either, dude. <laughs> Whoever what wanted to go to school. Yeah. <laughs> hey, what's up, you freaking twinks? Whoa, Cody, did you get a new Twinks pump? is crazy. <laughs> yeah, I did. My mom got it for me so I don't have to walk to school. <laughs> I feel like it's distracting from my bike. <laughs> I'm not going to lie. Cody looks very uncomfortable sitting on the bike like that. Yeah. <laughs> well, I think we should all focus on how cool <coughs> the new bike is. But there's a cat. <laughs> kitty, 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 kitty. Yeah, but kitty, kitty. Oh, yeah, the cat's more cooler kitty. than the bike. I agree. But look at the kitty. Yeah, the cat's gone. Oh. My bike, though. Oh, yeah, you got a bike. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I did. Joseph, you see his bike? Yeah, dude. Bro, I haven't run a bike in so long. Oh, shit. I don't. Uh, I guess the stereotypes are true, Hannah. <laughs> we have to see him at school later. Well, I guess I'll just walk to school with you. Come on, let's go. I ain't never seen Joseph do something like that. Right, Today, we're going to be learning how octopuses reproduce <laughs> when a male octopus. What is that? Why? Why? What, why do we need to learn why octopuses produce? That has nothing to do with anything. Octopus, he wants to bang. He rips off his penis <laughs> and literally pulls it out. And he dies. So he literally dies for the pussy. Or <laughs> octopus. Octopus is crazy. I already ripped off my wiener and threw it at you. Uh, Junior, I really don't know how to take it. Really that. romantic. Joseph, where's my bike? Oh, I saw that shit. Oh. Yeah, I had him equip buck, tight shit, tight shit. Yeah. Damn, Joseph, you don't do that to your friends, hey, my boy. Teacher, can I go to the bathroom? I eat too many Takis and then my butthole's on fire. Yes, boy. <laughs> TMI. TMI. I'm going to the bathroom, which means I'm skipping school. You coming too, Penelope? I clean my room again. No, bully. I have a boyfriend now. <laughs> okay, just know my room is damn, clean. Damn, damn. Penelope been around the block. Hold on. <laughs> Penelope, what does he mean by that, that his, that his room is clean? <laughs> I don't know, Junior. Well, that's got to be some kind of inside joke between you two. Okay, well, Junior, before you and I started going out, I was seeing Bully, and there was one day I was over at his house, and we were watching Seinfeld on the couch, and then we started making out, and that was it. You made out with Bully? Yeah, we made out, and then I left. That was it, Junior. And then the next day, he asked me if I was coming over, and I said no, and he said, but I clean my room for you. Why'd he clean his room for you? I don't know. No, you have to know. He didn't just say that. That's gotta be some kind of sick inside joke between you two. <laughs> what? No. Maybe his room was just dirty. I think happened. I think y'all were making out on the couch, and he wanted you to do something to his wiener, and you said no. I won't do it in your living room because your parents might see. And you said, "Why?" <laughs> oh my gosh, bro. <laughs> of course, Junior goes that right. His story was sounding good at first, but then he went just the whole other direction. Go to your room, and he goes, "No, my room's too dirty. I don't want you to see my room dirty." And you're like, "Well, how about if you clean your room, then I'll do stuff to your wiener?" And then he cleaned his room. Junior, you're being crazy. <laughs> you know what? I gotta go. My dad's checking me out early because I have a doctor's appointment. Bye. No, no. This is what no, happens you when you're young and in a relationship. Hey, Insecurities. Do, do, do. I hate when hey, Cody do. does that. Wait, why long face? <laughs> Guys, I feel so much better after that dude. Wait, <laughs> Junior's just thinking of all the, the possibilities. Fully and Penelope made out. Well, didn't that happen before you guys even got together? Yeah, but he cleaned his room for her. See, I told you that hoe was a thought. <laughs> Thank you, Joseph. <laughs> Junior, sometimes Joseph don't give no hoes the no, benefit no, of the doubt. No, I wouldn't either. Bro, shit. I'll be real with my nigga. Like, like, hey, shit, hoe. No one just cleans their room for fun. Okay, people only clean their rooms when their parents yell at them or unless a girl promises to bang you. Think about it. Penelope and Bully were making out on his couch, <laughs> oh, damn. and he wanted her to do stuff to his wiener, and she said, no, I don't want to do it in the living room. I want to go to your room to do it because I don't want your parents to see. And he said, no, my room's way too dirty. We, we can't go to my room. And then she said, how about this? If you clean your room, then I'll come over and I'll do stuff to your wiener. 
<laughs> at this point, <laughs> Junior obviously is assuming right now, uh, so it's an assumption, but he's also making up shit at this point, which is falls in the same category. Hey, you're making a lot of assumptions. I mean, how dare right. you would have to be that he would turn down her doing stuff to his wiener? Right. Like, he would have to have pizza boxes stacked all the way to the ceiling. Like, actual... I don't think any guy... I know how... I, I, look, I know how niggas are. I know how we think. A nigga is not going to care. First of all, I mean... It's up to you if you like to keep your shit clean or not. I mean, I keep my stuff very clean. That's just the kind of person I am. But I'm sure there's women, there's women that are dirty enough to do some dirty shit in a dirty environment. That's how they are. For him to turn that down. I mean, yeah, his room would have to have been dirty. I, it just doesn't make any sense. Like the first <laughs> thing I do when I invite a friend over for the first time is show him my room. You know, I say peep the room. Peep the bunk bed. Check out the room. Check the bed. You know what I'm trying to say? Like, you're a bad host. Like, as soon as they went to his house, she, he said, we ought to stay in the living room. We can't go to my room. Something's up, Cody. Something's up. <laughs> There's two things making me upset. There's that and one other thing. Well, what's the other thing? I hate water towers. Water towers? It doesn't make any sense. Like, why Why are water towers in the air? Like, the mayor's like, hey, <laughs> when you're water. mad, about, when you get mad about something, other shit, random shit just starts pissing you off, bro. Like, that's how I go. <laughs> and they said, where should we store it? He goes, up there, 50 feet in the air. That's where I want to store it. Not on the ground. I want to store it 50 feet in the air. So it's really hard to get. I to. never even so thought about this. that. I guess Junior has a valid point. That's a water tower. But Wouldn't water towers, I'm pretty just sure, help us with certain things. Water just on the ground so everyone can get to it. But no, they say. <laughs> Let's put it 50 feet in the fucking air. That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, it's suspicious, dude. Yeah, why? Like, people are running around <laughs> pillaging and destroying towns and poisoning water supplies. We don't have to do this anymore. We can just put the water right on the ground. This is like, I don't understand why it has to be so high in the air. Like, how'd they even get all that water up there? Why? Water weighs so much. Like, that's, that's the size of it. Like, three. All right, Junior, we get it, bro. <laughs> Maybe this is his way of venting and trying to keep his mind off of, you know, Penelope and Bully. <laughs> like, how the hell did they get it all the way up there, Cody? But I, I, I don't know, Junior. I don't understand it either. So there's two <laughs> things I need you to do for me, Cody. I need you to find out why water towers are in the air. Like, is that even is that even smart to do that? Okay. <laughs> and then I need you to go get a dick pic from Bully. Like, I need to know if his wiener's hey, bigger than yo. me. Hey, yo! <laughs> <one else. laughs> Junior's so insecure right now, bro. Oh, my like, God. Hey, I'm bigger than him. <laughs> <laughs> then then I'll, then I'll stay with him. Oh, okay, well, I'm happy to do a little bit of research. <laughs> oh, yeah, I was going to say. Snapchat and pretend that I'm a girl. Actually, hell, I could probably use my own. I'm pretty good at this. It's a weird request, dude. I need to know. Also, okay, I mean, all you got to do is Google the water tower yet, information. I figure out the water tower thing. So apparently they put the water up there so that gravity naturally pulls the water down and creates water pressure so it goes through the pipes. Oh, die. Well, that's the answer. Oh, die. No, die today. That's so stupid. What a dumb <laughs> answer. Well, that's the answer. I'm no, about. you know, it's so stupid. You're telling me they put the water up there for it to come back down. Well, yeah, so they don't have to build a pump. Yes, they do have to build a pump. How do you think the water gets up there? They have to pump the water up there. So they already have to build a pump. Well, they only have to pump it once, and then gravity does the rest. <laughs> no, how about you just put the water on the ground, and then you use the pump to pump the water out to people? Yeah, that's a waste of time, dude. But then you'd have to have it constantly pumping. This way, you just pump once, and then have gravity pull it back down. Oh, no, I bet it's constantly pumping water up there, because you know how much water humans use? Oh, he oh die. Shut up. I don't want to hear that anymore. <laughs> There's I'm probably sorry. millions of water towers all over the place, to be honest. Yeah, I'm water sure you see them everywhere. Oh, wait, Bully sent the dick pic. Let me see. Oh, hey, yo. Snapchat because the file was too big. He had to email it. Oh, it's in drop. He said, he, had to, he said the file was too big. He had to email it. Chill out, bro. Oh, it's, oh, it's in a compressed zip file. Hold on. <laughs> the zip file is two terabytes? I can't download that. <laughs> <laughs> the storage is full. Junior, we're going to need another Chill, phone. bro. Oh, Chill. Like, Chill. They act like I sent the motherfucking picture or some shit. No. <laughs> gonna they going crazy, okay, bro. I bet. I bet. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, sweet Jesus. Junior, that's just the tip. Junior, we're, we're going to need a bigger <laughs> screen. We have to go to the movie theater. We have to project this onto an IMAX screen. <laughs> Cordy, I mean, I mean, mean Cody horny ass, bro. Screen, but it $10. And they got popped. He might lose his job, so it should be coming on any second now. <laughs> oh, my God, Junior. It's so massive. <laughs> it's taking up the whole screen. <laughs> Honestly, I mean, bro. He must have used anything. 35 millimeter IMAX camera to take this picture. That's an Oppenheimer cock. 
Oh god, Cody, he's huge. It's the biggest thing I've ever seen. There's no way I can compete with that. <laughs> Ain't no way Bully is like that, bro. There. Stop it. it. Ends over there. Stop and the worst it. part is, we don't even see the balls. Who knows how far behind those are? Oh god, if she did anything with him, it's over. It's, it's completely over. Oh, Junior. Oh. First of all, if Penelope did anything with Bully, he is this size. There's no way she would have been able to or survive, especially at the age that she is. Like, come on, oh, bro. Oh, no, you better hope she did. Oh, oh, oh my god, Junior. I Maybe they're just being dramatic. Just That's how big it was. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm sorry, Junior. That was a huge dude. Oppenheimer cock. Oh, well, damn. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. Oh, I have to leave her. I have to break up with her. No, you don't, Junior. You don't even know if she did anything. It's that big. It's huge. I have to break up with her. <laughs> it's the right thing to do, dude. Thanks, Joseph. It's the right thing well, to I do, dude. Go, bro, but I think you know what to do. I'm going to break up with her. I'm going to call her right now, tell her to come over. And I'm gonna tell her I just can't do this anymore. No, oh, come on, Junior, don't do that. <laughs> I have to. I've never seen Junior hey, this Junior. sad in an episode this long. <gasps> Junior, what's wrong? Oh no, is it the water tower thing again? It just doesn't make sense. Why are they in the air? Junior, I already explained this to you. <laughs> it doesn't make sense. Nothing you can say makes it make sense. Junior, you need to get over it. I think we should break up. What? Over the water tower thing? No, over bully. What? I saw his penis. What, Junior? What are you talking about? <laughs> Not so you we being blunt. And we tried looking at it, and it wouldn't load on a phone screen. So we had to go to a movie theater, <laughs> and we saw it on an IMAX screen, and it's huge. So we need to go. Bro, in real life, if you come out about this to a girl that you're talking to, you this jealous is over with, bro. She fin you finna be embarrassed for the rest of your life. There's just no way. Wiener. What? I'm not going to go be with Bully, Junior. <laughs> he gets to have you. He wins. He gets to have me? Yes, he won the size contest. He's way bigger than me, so go be with him. You'd be happy to win. <laughs> Junior, we're in like fifth grade. Why are we even talking about this kind of stuff? Because, exactly, we're in fifth grade. It's already that big. He has so much more growing to do. I'm not going to get any bigger. I saw my dad get out of the shower. I've peaked. I'm not going to get any bigger. <laughs> Junior, this is ridiculous. I'm not going to go be with Bully. There's His dad is kind of crazy looking, us. too. Oh, bull crap. I, if it's that big, you had to do something with it. If, it's, if, if my thing was that big, I'd whip it out every chance I get. I mean, honestly, Junior, honestly, though, girls don't, girls always say size... I like remember I did a video here on the channel asking girls does size matter and most girls said it doesn't matter it's about how you use it Just I was shocked by those answers but lie. I didn't know if I no, believed them or not okay then you stay right here I'll invite bully over and if he lies you call him a liar straight to his face okay fine all right I'm gonna get bully uh, hey what's up scrub <laughs> hey he bought the bike <laughs> earlier today from your friend Joseph oh okay so that's where it went bully I need to speak to you okay so you sent a wiener pick to Cody earlier today and your wiener's huge oh that thing <laughs> yeah that's my favorite practical joke I like to pull on people. I just find a random wiener pic on Google Images, and then I just put it in Photoshop and set the dimensions to be as big as an IMAX screen. <laughs> it's hilarious. It crashes people's phones. So, that wasn't your wiener? No, man. We're in fifth grade. Why would I send a picture of my wiener to somebody? <laughs> 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 okay, bully. Okay. Oh, you and Penelope made out on your couch like before she was dating me, right? Yeah. So why'd you clean your room for her? Oh, well, she wanted to go to my room to play Fortnite, but I said no because I pee in my bed a lot, and instead of changing the sheets, <laughs> I just put newspaper on there, like in the movie Big Daddy. So then the next day, I told her that I cleaned my room, but she didn't want to come over. <laughs> <laughs> so she's never done anything to your wiener? No, of course not, man. We're in fifth grade. <laughs> oh. Well, I'm gonna go. Wait, wait, where the hell is my bike? Hey, get back here, dork! So, Junior, do you feel any better? I'm surprised Bully no, ain't talking about bitches at this age. <laughs> junior and MR. They way up there. It doesn't make sense to put water 50 feet in the air. It can just be on the ground. Oh, my God. It just doesn't make sense. Someone please explain to me. <laughs> Bro, when you're that young, that's a phase of your life that you have to get through, guys. You feel me? Like, everybody goes through that. Like, for Junior to have that experience, it's human. You know what I mean? It happens to, to every young person growing up. But also another thing too, when it comes to when it comes to uh uh when it comes to men getting with a woman, right? Let me know in the comments down below. If y'all found out your girl's past, the one that you were wanting to be with or the one you are with, you found out her past and it was too much and you knew what she did and she was honest about it, would you stay around? Mm, this is before you. I want to know real comment, real answers. As always, the original video will be in the description down below while you guys are down there. If you would like to follow me on my other channel, I am posting a video over there tomorrow. Thank you guys for the continued support. I love y'all, and I will see you guys in the next one, baby. We are out. Peace.